Smudge, cover for us. I can't. I was never good at that. We have to. We can't stop the show. Time's moving on. Why me? Because I can't breathe. Jinx needs time to congeal, and Sparky's writing the words to Perfidia on his hand. <laughs> what do I say? I don't know. Talk to them. Tell them about stuff. Uh, while Jinx is clotting, I'll forge ahead. You know the saying, you can't take it with you? Well, you can, you're allowed one suitcase. <laughs> so we packed our props and the base charts, and I snuck in my record collection. that they were the Ames brothers or the four aces. Then I graduated to LPs. What a feeling, getting a new record, sliding your thumbnail inside the album jacket, breaking the cellophane. We, the guys and I, we used to dream of making our own records. We even made these neat covers. <laughs> the plaid's in a blue moon. <laughs> the plaid swing down broad. And the Christmas album. Plaid titles. <laughs> Although we never had any records to sell at one of our shows, we would sell the empty covers and dream of the day that we could stuff us. <laughs> it was a good dream. Is Jinx coagulating? Yeah, it's time for her video. Right? It's time for her video. In his final interview, Enrico Caruso stated that he would concentrate on his tortured romances when he sang, and this would make the sound emanate from deeper within his bowels. <laughs> oh. <laughs> or was that Eddie Fisher? 